Food like update, Danny Boy here. We're back with more transport fever on the modded map. Uh, just keeping an eye on these iron ore trains, which are slowly, slowly delivering ore. Uh, we need these ships to be a hundred. Unfortunately, they are not. Although this scene is the you know the pink line is the Cardiff ore slash steel shipping, but these are also uh, shipping ore and steel. So hopefully this scene will get you to the road, and then this scene will be able to get in. If it had more traffic lights, or signals even, in order to get these to free up space so they can get in each uh, the right place. Like these are kind of stuck here because this is moving so slow, 14 miles per hour, uh, 13 miles per hour. We're desperately in need of oh, a more powerful train. But hey ho, this guy should deliver and this guy will hit 100, or should have 100, if he can get in in time. So we're in May of 1907, that's him delivered, he should be full, ooh, four. Waiting on four, cheeky. I thought he would have been full, where is the next train? Uh, that's a fuel train, but there is this blasting down and we'll see the queue of trains these uh, Prussians are just not strong enough to haul uh, these wagons although they're doing quite fast on the way back it's just this hill they get stuck with if this was flat it would be perfect they would manage no problem but he's clear so does that mean the unit at the station is clear hopefully I believe that ship is gone. No, it's still there. He goes in. Jing. Okay. Now, are you full now? Yes, 96. And it's even left 61 for the next train to come in. So that's fine. Which is probably still down here. Yep, it's there. But, hey-ho. Uh, we'll have a quick look over in... Paris. We have actually got passengers now. Three and two. Uh, this is the London train. It's got 14 of 84. Not bad. The Copenhagen train. 13 of 84. So they're starting to pick up. Uh, Paris. There you go. It's growing. 81 plus. Uh, the plus sign just means that it's still it's starting to expand. Amsterdam is still doing well. It's growing as well. We could probably get a line up to Paris from Amsterdam, but just now, uh, what we are getting is, and uh, do I have a dock in here? No, I do not. Let's buy one. Now, what are you actually facing? The dock can go in there. So there it goes. There's the dock. Let's buy a ship. The RMS Lusitania by Ship 26. No, that will be the RMS Lusitania. Nice. Right. Set this on a line. It's going to be a new line and it's going to be. Uh, Uh, Atlantic liners right because they're going to cross the Atlantic they're going to do Atlantic crossings that's what they did in real life so that's what they're going to do here right go to Dublin first <coughs> now I've just left Dublin here look at it that is ridiculous it's the halfway is in this guy's house <laughs> Uh, here's a couple of buses and stuff coming in. We've got a bus, a post bus, uh, a tram. Oh, coming into this station at once. Hopefully people will use this. It is actually connected. Although that tree is kind of in the road. Oh well. But there it goes. The RMS Lusitania. Now we're going to pause it. Because once he goes there... He's going to come over here to 
uh, New York. And here is New York. Right, that's him in. Now, at this side, we're going to do the same. We're going to place another depot, or shipyard even, in New York. Uh, adding the shipyard's a bit laggy, I reckon why. Buy ships and we're going to buy the RMS Mauritania. So, we'll change you as well. RMS Mauritania. Is that right? Yes. So, if you download the ship for the, or the two ships, uh, for the Steam Workshop, it also gives you the history of the ship. Uh, these ships unfortunately didn't last very long. Uh, the RMS Lusitania was a British ocean liner that a German submarine sunk in World War One, so it had a very short lifetime. This liner launched the world's largest ship until the completion of the Olympic. It'd be nice to see the Olympic. The Titanic is on the Steam Workshop, and we haven't got it. I can't change the sound blue again. Why is she clearing away? Fastest transatlantic crossing during 1909 season. We'd hold both speed records. Okay. So, there is the history of the Mauritania. We'll get set on it line. Atlantic liners. Where are you heading for? New York West. That is perfect. So, here is the RMS Mauritania. And across the Atlantic is the RMS Lusitania. And then when the Titanic comes on the go, we'll set her on the same route. Uh, fortunately, it will mark its maiden voyage, unlike its fate in reality, or it did not. And uh, if you didn't again for happened to the Titanic, then you've obviously been living in some sort of dark, dark hole for the last uh, century. Uh, you definitely need to get out more. But there it is. I don't know if these are actually going to work. It would be cool if they did work. But there they are. Uh, New York is over there. There is the Lusitania heading towards New York. Uh, you can actually see the props, the propellers. Lusitania, Liverpool. Uh, they're not actually turning just now, but they do turn. Uh, I think once the ship gets up to its max speed, it actually stop. 29 miles per hour. And your top speed is 30 something. With the Titanic only has like a top speed of, of like 12 or something. So it'd be nice if they matched their, uh, their sort of sister ships. Unfortunately, they do not. So, there we go. We've got our two cruise liners on the go. Uh, let's have a look at the steel situation. Lots of steel, but you're not getting... Oh, you have got steel. Thank God. Nice. And there is 98 slag. And you've got 100 slag. Ooh, everything's coming up better. Details. We still need more uh, iron ore. Now let's have a look over here. Details, dink, there we go, requirement, store 213, zero goods are being stored, that's bad, that is really bad, is it the same here, yes, it says to deliver more planks, but planks is not the problem, it's steel, so we absolutely need more steel, zero of a hundred, damn it, where are the steel trains? One's heading back, two's heading back with full loads. Okay, uh, how are the planks trains coming along? You actually need wood. Holy crap. Uh, we'll hit upgrade these. We're just really waiting for something better to come on the go. But speaking of that, these, uh, if we go in our, uh, we'll keep it on play actually, 
we shall head over here. Some of these Austrian trains are getting a bit old. Some of the Russian trains over there are getting a bit old. So we're going to have to replace them soon. We also need to replace some more British fuel trains. Uh, so they need to get done as well. Moscow food train, 30 years old. It's got a lifespan of 35. But if we go over and here, look. We'll have a look at each line individually. Uh, Minsk food shipping could be done with some more. Uh, this needs to really fire food across to these trucks faster. Although I think it is actually trying. Right. How old are you? 24. You've got about 10 years left. You're fairly new. I think that's the OA or the OB on there. So he does not need replaced. 14 years. It's about halfway there. Now this is definitely getting quite old. These two trains. 30 years old. Uh, these were once white. Uh, once upon a time. They've obviously, they're very dirty now. Uh, these start to age. They do, they've aged a wee bit. Now do you get a full load, 68? No. Okay, if it's the details here, if it's happening, you're sort of sticking with that. It's fine. Right, you're on your way back. So, the cow trains, let, in fact, let's find a cow train. Details, 24 years old, he's got about another 10 years left. Not really wanting to upgrade them, not really fussed about them. 200 of 200, excellent. How old are you? 23 years old. So we'll say you've got another 10 years left to go as well. These are quite new, yep, 12 years. Now, there's a lot of fuel waiting for St. Petersburg. So, without further ado, uh, details 23 but it's looking quite ancient so how much does he carry a hundred okay let's set a replacement for you so replacement uh, get rid of that uh, now let me see locomotives we're looking for something Russian we do have the OA here or the OB 95 kilonewtons, 37 miles per hour. 87, 31. And the previous train we had on was this, 31 at 60. So I think we're going to go with the OB. Uh, we'll add it on, because we've got some OAs running. I'm not even sure if it is an A, it's like an acrylic A. Now we need Russian tank wagons, which are these, uh, 12, okay, go 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Uh, set to replace now, and yes. And we'll slow it down. There's our Moscow to Kiev. Oh, it's actually starting to pick up. Although the spacing of these could be better. Two of 150. Because he just sort of gets in just after this one's left. He's going at his top speed. See, that's an OA. But hey, oh, one does good. The other end doesn't do so good. Uh, really, he should be here at Kiev by the time he gets to St. Petersburg. But unfortunately, he is not. Uh, right, we're watching the fuel train. It's there. Okay. Now, if I go up here, the second line in. We'll go on to the second line in. Uh, give me a depot. Just one of these smines. Just new. Stick it on there. Buy a train. Now... Locomotives, we'll go with another one of these. Uh, wagons, we'll go the fuel wagons again. Uh, another 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 
set it on a line, it'll be STP fuel train, there it is. Right, so that's him on his way. How are these getting on? Their stored uh, crude oil is coming down. But these trains should be good enough to keep it uh, stocked. See, that's an OA. And these are the OBs. <laughs> right. Are you going to be able to go? I've got signals on here, so it should be fine. Right, away you go. 120. Perfect. Right, this thing, this guy up here has changed. Now, I'm just wondering if with the new extra, will there be enough trucks? Right, let's see a look at the STP fuel lines. Stockholm, STP bus, Fuel Road 1 and Fuel Road 2. Let's add uh, can stats please. 1, 2, 3, 4. Set them for fuel. Uh, there and there. Set them on a line. STP Fuel Road 1. And then we'll get four more, one, two, three, four. Set them on STP Fuel Road 2. And that should keep it sort of going. Because there's going to be, as I suspect, there will be an excess of fuel buildup. Now that we're tra uh, transporting 240 instead of the standard 100. Uh, fuel here is doing good. Uh, Weird Russian glitch train is actually going with full loads, so 150, excellent. 85, hopefully the train will get in again. Very unlikely since it's only here. Uh, how much is waiting? Uh, a lot. He'll get 200 on the way back. Okay. Now we'll have to keep an eye out on these trains but so far they're okay uh, I wouldn't have mind upgrading some of the passenger trains 24 years old uh, we need a new wagon and a sort of new passenger train to come on the go before we can start delivering that stuff let's have a look at these 4 of 4 4 of 4 people are using that so that's good. Let's have a look at the rating. So that's going up the good. 53%. It was it mediocre. Same here. Good. Still at mediocre. Is somebody using these? 4 of 4. 4 of 4. 4 of 4. Okay, so people are using that. Excellent. Right. Now, if I go over here, I want to replace some of these Austrian trains. Which one is the oldest? Details, 15. And details, 7. Uh, details, 15. Looks like the ones that are 15 are the oldest. Uh, there should be another rain up here. 11. Okay, right. I'm going to set you to go back to the depot and sell yourself. And then I'm going to replace this in. I'm going to... Uh, once you are empty, I'm going to send you back to the depot to replace yourself. Go to the depot and sell yourself. Right. If it's happening here. Tons of grain stored. Tons of food being stored. For some reason, it's nae putting it across to this train. Uh, I have no idea why. But let's set a replacement for it. Uh, push play, actually. 
Right. Replacement. Uh, locomotives, we're going to use this. 187 kilonewtons of pool and power. Now, it says it's a mountain express train. They are also ideal for heavy goods traffic. Excellent. Right. Odd one of those. Uh, wagons, we're going to use... There was a new wagon available. Uh, I can't actually remember for it is. I'm positive there was a new wagon available. Maybe there's no. Uh, let's go wagons. Let's go freight. Alright, that's the finished wagon. This is our sort of old stuff. Uh, that's a refrigerated wagon. Uh, how fast does this train actually go? I'm tempted to use this Russian wagon. Holds 12, top speed of 50. Uh, let's go to the locals. How fast do you go? 43. So on a thing we have speed over, at 43 or over is ideal. Normal goods wagon, top speed 50. You only hold four. So we'll get used these. Right. Odd. Uh, pick up food. You also pick up food. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Set that to replace now. And yes. Who are you? Vienna Goods. How old are you? 20 years old. You're going to be replaced. Uh, you're going to be replaced. What are you waiting for? You go to the depot and sell yourself. Unable to find path. That's not true. Uh, if I stick this in here and I fire in a depot there. You go and get sold. Right, so this is our uh, trains being upgraded. Jing, nice. Right, he's gone. Uh, pause, we'll get set you to replace. Replacement. Uh, this. Near this scene, although it's quite fast and it's got quite a big tract of effort, but we're getting to go with this scene. Freight, we're getting to go with these again. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Replace now, and yes. Now, I'm not sure if they'll actually match up. I'm kind of hoping that they will. Uh, you. Go to the depot and sell yourself. Now we should hear a third one of these grain trains somewhere. I believe this is it here. Yes. Okay. Alright, let's set that to replace. Uh, it's carrying 80. Let's see if we can get a bit more. Locomotives. Steam. One of these. Add. Freight. Now, open wagons we're kind of needing. This is a Russian open wagon, 1900, does 50, car is 12, uh, the early gondola, or there's the wooden gondola, uh, I think we'll go, is there anything else, seems to be everything, it most certainly does, hold on, push pause, Right, because we want you to change. Right, first that Russian number that does 12. Drain 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Replace now and yes. So this is the last of our old school Austrian trains being replaced. Uh, with three billion in the bank, 
I might actually for an episode stick the costs on just to see if it actually makes money or doesn't it make money. I would like to activate the mod that gets rid of trains that are old and are no longer being produced. Just to stop the uh, the depots for getting clogged up. Right, hold on. Ooh, I like the sound of that train. Right, do you actually... Oh, you fit perfect. Alright, cool. On you go, Buster. 121 and 46. Uh, I'm not entirely sure why this only gets 46. Let's see a look at it. See, these Russian wagons actually look okay. Uh, you wouldn't even be able to tell it's Russian. It's not got any writing or anything on it. Beep beep. Looks like we've got a new vehicle though. Uh, the GWR4483 well, 3300. Ooh, you got a full load straight away. Yeah, it's got some uh, whistle on that train. 57 of a of 132. You must have an extra car of your buster that you're not supposed to hear. Right, start shipping the food across. Since you were complaining that I was not shipping enough food. Right, now. We do hear lines going uh, Beijing and Copenhagen. Details. 26 years old. We should replace that. And details. 20 years old. We'll maybe replace them soon. That's what I'd like to do. Let's get this uh, Austrian number, the big guy, on a line down here to Tokyo. Now I think that would be pretty sweet as per usual. We didn't have a Japanese or Chinese train to sort of run on that line. Which is uh, unfortunate, but I'm going to stick in a Austrian train. No, I just want to delete this bit and that bit. Now, this one will be a through station. It'll just be a terminus. A terminal station. Right. How much do I want on here? Give me eight. Just now. 120, 400. Second street connection. Do I want to curve it? No. Do I want to sort of... Where do I want to place it? This side? Is there anywhere I can place it? That thing looks a bit... Woofed. Well, it's not looking good. Uh, okay. What are we doing here? Ooh, it doesn't like any of this. This actually looks neat too. There we go. Park a bit. And there. Okay. That looks kind of terrible. Bring that out there. Wait, were you large? Are you large road? No, you still are just medium road. It looked like large road, right? You connected there. Which you did. Warning, train 7 has reached its lifetime. It is not really because the last other, uh, the last for 35 years, and they're only 25 years old. Uh, right, give me this out of here. Into there. Give me a line. Now it's giving me some sort of insane bridge that I didn't want. Uh, that looks kind of terrible. Screw it. In it goes. Nope. Enough with the madness. Just give me a 
Nice, straight. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Vast amount of smoothing is going to be required here. But the station is in. Uh, I'll change that road there to medium street. I dare say. Right, hopefully the game builds stuff in here so it does not look stupid. But it's in anyway. I still need to get a road up this side. I suppose there's plenty of room for an airport or something over here. It looks kind of flat. Although I could be wrong because this station uh, struggled to fit in. It's uh, new though. Alright, let's uh, give me this. Give me that. Alright. Uh, give me back to that. Uh, you come out here. Come down there. Come along there. Go on it. No. Go on to there. Perfect. Right. And we'll bring it up and round. Into there, please. There we go. Ooh, now I need to get a station in somewhere. The station's probably going to go in here. Still need to unlock that uh, Fiji McCart station. The sort of V-shaped tram station. I'm hoping to unlock it soon. Right, just go in there some way, if you can. Smooth that out so it does not look completely ridiculous. Smooth it out there. Then I'll have to figure out where the lines or roads are going. Into there. Come across there, just for the sake of it. Uh, you... Come out to there. Uh, go up that way. Connect into there. Uh, come across here. There. No, just give me something normal, please. Nothing fancy. Right, you connect to that. Now, I just saw you. I seen that you connected. You in there. Uh, if it just happened there, nothing. Right, you round to there. You go into there. Perfect. <laughs> well, I've no idea for the for the routes are going to go for buses and stuff. Is this station in range or anything? It is in range of a few things. Okay. I suppose I could do the tram coming out around here, but for now I think we'll just do... We'll come back to it. We'll do a bit more infrastructure, but just now... We'll just get here one bus stop in the centre of town. Uh, give me a road depot. Uh, there, please. Smooth that. There we go. Smooth out of this. Right. Buy a road vehicles. Just now, just give me one of these. Set it on a line. It'll be a new line. And we will expand Tokyo as it progresses. So, T-O-K bus. Uh, we could probably have Beijing to Tokyo bus as well, because that's actually not too far away. But just now we'll get the line patched in. Right, one, two, five, yes please. Uh, go that side. Too much slope, far are you near too much slope, you're there. Uh, come up around there. Now, fits a lot to happen here. Uh, you go away. This is get, probably going to give me some sort of bridge, can it? Do I want a bridge? Uh, 
Uh, far in there. Escape, go away. Right, you... Seventy eight. You also seventy eight. Right. That's the truck, it's on the right. And they are too much slope. Okay. Well, two can play that game. Too much slope. I can pull it from here and there. And there's nothing you can do about it. There we go, right, a tunnel, so be it. Uh, you in there. Oh, is that joined up? No, it is now. Right, bit smooth and required. I uh, didn't even need to delete our road. Because we've just gone completely underneath it. And I can get rid of that. And this. And we'll stick in some signals. And then we'll run at uh, lightning fast Austrian train down here. And this is going to take a while to smooth. And I want it looking completely terrible. There we go. You and there. You and there. Get rid of that, please. Right. Signals. The train will be leaving facing that way. Correct. And then goes on here and there. Here and there, there and there. Let's get a set of signals as it comes in here. Uh, there and there. Now this Beijing line is quite Beijing. Right. In fact, who are you? Details. I'm going to replace you. So set replacement this is going to be steam. This is going to be this, the KK uh, from 1901, 62 miles per hour, 98 kilonewtons. Passenger. Right. We'll give you the, for, for is it, this. We'll give you this. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven. Right. Replace now, and yes. Uh, I might even stick a second train on there. Now, far is the train? It's only there. Okay, okay. Uh, go on, a uh, new line. This will be Vienna, V I E to Tokyo Express. Right, uh, you're going to go here in Vienna on platform three, and then you're going to go down here to Tokyo. Now let me see if it you've decided to go for. Aye, that's perfect. Uh, give me trains so I can match it up with this scene. Right, now for some reason this other train doesn't want to go on there. Because it cannot at this side. Right, hold on. Okay, that didn't really work. 
Aye, ah, okay, right. He's come in. Same, same. Right. Technically, right now you're on the wrong track. That's okay. I can live with that. Uh, let's throw some more signals in here. Right, plenty of signals there, plenty of signals there. Right, let's uh, give me a depot. Uh, push pause. Now give me a depot. Stick it over here. Right, you come in there. If you could go into there, that's fine. Right, now, buy trains. Another one of these, passenger. Now, we used these things for the first thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Set them on a line. Uh, Vienna to, or Beijing to Vienna, which is not there, so it must be Vienna to Beijing, yes, right, you go on and join that other train, right, steam, uh, this guy, I like that whistle, it's pretty cool actually. These things are slightly different, exactly the same, but just slightly different. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, duplicate our train. Set the first thing on the Vienna to Tokyo Express. Uh, who are you? You're the Copenhagen train. Should probably upgrade you as well. So here's our two new trains. Once this thing gets to the other side, I'll... I like the sound of that. <laughs> nice. <laughs> right, we're going to let them go. Uh, hopefully they're going to get held up too much. He's going to get held up straight away. He's already on his way back, so we'll maybe stop him at the next station. Yes, yes, go away. You're on your way, right. Uh, he's only going to Beijing though, which is just there. So it's kind of okay, work out okay. And here's how I'm coming into the station. With his upgraded train, perfect. Now, when you get to about Beijing, I'm going to swap you over. I do believe you'll hit to wait for this guy to uh, change. Do you? No, you deny. You just come straight in because he goes on that line and the way in. Perfect. Stuff start to grow outside of Beijing. Good. We'll hit to get a tunnel in to join up to there. Right. Play the game. Let him go there, because this sort of takes a while to get you to the station. Uh, Vienna to Tokyo Express. Away it goes. And then this little old school number coming in here. That was the food situation. Uh, who are you? You're waiting for 120. You're stuck at 80. This needs to fire stuff across faster. This thing's coming in with a full load. Okay. These things are pretty smart as well. If only we could use them in the other countries. We probably could, but we'll just get used them on here for the moment. Nice. Okay. Right, there's the Tokyo train. Uh, first Tokyo train has arrived. No passengers, as to be expected. But we will go and check this before we go. We'll probably want to wrap the episode up pretty soon.
No fuels waiting, that's fine. Uh, three or six, these should be set for a full load, they are. What's going on here? Oh no. For some reason it's now shunting everything over to the other line, okay. As soon as I added this second train, must have been too fast for the line. Uh, come on you, get going. Details. And I'm still putting across quite a lot. This thing will pick up 200. I'm not adding another train onto this line. If anything, I'll just upgrade it and make it bigger. But we'll leave these two running. How much is waiting for it? See, 17 already, 19, 20, 21, maybe 21. No, everything is going into the other train. Okay. Not much we can do about that. Let's have a look at our cruise liners. Uh, looking like zero. Uh, do I need to add another ship onto this line so that people go to it? Maybe. Is that somebody waiting there? No, they're waiting there. Okay. Uh, have you got somebody on you? No. Let's uh, add a ship to this line. See if that encourages people to go to it. Uh, yes, it will be the front and act by. Set it on a line. You're not exactly an Atlantic liner, but hey ho. But that's going to be it for this episode. We'll leave you here with the Mauritania as it cruises past. If you did actually watch this and you would like to leave a like or a comment, please do. And if you'd like to see more if it happens in the future, then hit the subscribe button. I've been Danny Boy, this has been Transport Fever, and I will catch you later.